You are now watching Tales from the Grid. In honor of the 31st anniversary of Power Rangers, Super 7 has released multiple products to celebrate the franchise. These products are a 90s inspired wave of metallic Mighty Morphin figures, an Ultimates Lord Draken figure, and a thousand piece puzzle. The Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Deluxe Wave features metallic 7 inch figures inspired by the original 90s figures. These figures come in the iconic triangle box packaging and features the Rangers blade blasters and their signature weapon as accessories. These deluxe wave figures cost $35 each, which is $20 cheaper than the Ultimates figures. Based on the product photos, it looks like these deluxe figures are repaints of the Ultimates figures. The price decrease could be due to the change in packaging and a decrease in the amount of accessories that come with the figure. The Ultimates figure came with 23 accessories, whereas the deluxe figures come with two. The fans get an Ultimates figure at a cheaper price point. The figures resemble the original 90s figures. Some fans may view nostalgic or retro styled figures as a way for a company to justify reducing the amount of accessories or the quality of the product. Repainting a pre-existing figure is a good way to sell the same figure twice. Nostalgia is a good way to use sentimental value to entice customers to justify certain purchase decisions. I like these figures and I would like these deluxe figures to extend to the Megazords. I would have liked these figures to have been a wide release instead of being a Hasbro Pulse exclusive. Will I buy? Yes. The Lord Draken figure looks very nice and comes with a handful of accessories. This figure is on pre-order for $55. This figure is a new character instead of a repaint of a pre-existing figure. Fans of Lord Draken get an Ultimates figure. This figure's packaging does not come with a packaging sleeve. Getting rid of the packaging sleeve could have been a solution to keep the figure's cost at $55. Lord Draken is a popular character, so he's a safe option to release as a new character. This figure may not really coincide with the 31st anniversary of Power Rangers, but since Lord Draken is Mighty Morphin related, I can see why he's being released. Will I buy? No. This Mighty Morphin Power Rangers puzzle is 1,000 pieces and is based on a Boom Studios comic book cover. This puzzle is $20. A 1,000 piece puzzle provides more value to the customers. There could possibly be a high ROI on puzzles. I would prefer more puzzle options. Will I buy? No. It was a bit concerning to see only one company out there acknowledge the anniversary. Hopefully this isn't a sign of a Power Ranger product drought in the oncoming year. Thank you for watching another episode of Tales from the Grid, and until next time, have a good one.